Today we'll be looking at riding on Birchbark. Most people are familiar with rune stones as well as rune sticks, but there were other mediums upon which writing was done in the Viking Age. Birch bark is a fantastic medium for many things. If uh, you have any experience with um, with bushcraft, you'll find that it's it's useful for making sheaths for knives. Uh, experimental archaeologists have found good ways of making sheaths for spears. But historically, there are finds of manuscripts writing on uh, birch bark. One of the most um, most interesting finds is out of Novgorod, where they have found a number of manuscripts in Old Church Slavonic, in uh, vernacular Novgorodian, and there was one, one find that was in Old Norse. Granted, a lot of these finds uh, post-date the Viking Age. They're from roughly the 13th century. To do it yourself, all you really need is birch bark and a pointy object, such as this one, the stylus. Styluses uh, have been found being made of bronze as well as iron, but it is not a ludicrous assumption to believe that styluses made with more organic material were also quite common. Because of the softness of the inside of birch bark, it does not take much effort to simply press onto it with the pointy object and drag to carve any characters. The softness also attributes it the, uh, the ease to draw curved lines, which means that not only writing but also drawing was very, very possible. In fact, some of the most interesting finds of Birchbark manuscripts were the homework and drawings of a six-year-old boy that went by the name of Old Fien. Birchbark, in terms of writing, was very much like a notepad. You would write very simple things, like a reminder to get milk from the goat farmer, or that another man was, uh, was killed. But also, it was very common to see very colorful insults written on the Oh, hey, Raffinkel! Why, you? Go, 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 go! If you enjoyed today's video, please give a like and subscribe. And check out the links below to see how you can support us.